Well, hello. Good luck. Good luck. I know. Uh, hope I didn't scare you. Uh, well, today, I really didn't know what I wanted to do, but I don't know if y'all can see, but my face is really hating me right now. I've got like pimples everywhere. So I figured I would show you how I use all that clinic stuff that I bought. And then I'm also gonna throw in this mask by Bliss. So we'll just go ahead and get started. I'm just gonna go in with the little um, brush that I got from Clinique that day and then I got all the other skincare stuff with the cleanser. This is the liquid facial soap for sure, for sure. The liquid facial soap oily skin formula they have all kinds of different ones for different kinds of skin but that's what I'm gonna use and for this one I mean it's gonna be kind of worn cuz I ain't at a sink so I just got me a little bowl of water and I'm just gonna dip it you want it wet so I'm just gonna dip the bristles in there got me a towel and then I've found that this stuff goes such a long way so I'm only gonna put that much on there hopefully you saw but it's I mean it's clear so you can't even see it I'm actually gonna take another towel and dip it in that water and wet my face a little bit circular motion Don't want to keep it on one spot for too long because that ain't good either. But look at that. I don't know if y'all remember how clean it started. But that's gross. I will clean that off later. And then just going to take the same uh, towel that I dampened my face with and hopefully be able to clean all of the filth off and I actually really liked this cleanser because it leaves my face feeling so good and of course you just want to pat dry the less rubbing you do on your face the better because rubbing means wrinkles and like I always say nobody got time for them wrinkles But I used to have so many blackheads, and they're pretty much all gone. Knock on wood. Um, so after you cleanse, obviously wait for it to dry. And then we're going to go in. This is a fairly new mask to me. I've only tried it twice. Both times it's been different, so I don't know how I feel about it yet. But it's by the brand Bliss. And it's called Mask Appeal. And it's supposed to be like this. I've never felt a mess like this before. But it's supposed to be like this rubberized peel off mask. So you get it. I've already used the other two like I said. But you get three of them in here. They're 30 bucks, $10 a piece if you just. They do have the little individuals you can buy for 10 bucks. But in the big box it comes with a little spatula. You get one if you just buy the individual two. Um but you just open it carefully or it will go everywhere and it's just a powder I don't know if you can see just a powder so then they say to it has this fill line right here fill water too and I tried that the first time it was super clumpy I don't know what happened and maybe I was just too slow or it says to add three tablespoons. So that's what I got in my little bowl. Three tablespoons exactly. So I'm just going to add it. Well, that actually looked like a lot compared to last time. And then you just mix it. Now I will say the first time I probably did work too slow. Because the second time that I did the three tablespoons. I um, mixed it really quickly. Because you're supposed to mix it until it's smooth. And then um, apply it to your face. And the longer it sat in the container, the stiffer it got. 
so it stiffens up really really quick but girl get in there and get all your masks cause for $10 a piece it's kind of expensive and this is what I come out with and so then using the spatula you just apply and again I'm looking over here because I have my mirror and it smells horrible I hate how it smells it's almost not even worth the use because of the smell Ooh, you don't want to get it too close to your eyeballs now I don't know if it'll make you go blind You don't want to get this in your mouth because, again, it doesn't smell that great, so I'm assuming it doesn't taste good. Okay. So, I mean, I'm covered pretty good. Y'all can see. I still have that much left. So, like I said, it kind of sucks because I can't use it all, but look how fast it sets. I mean, it's already, like, rubberizing. So, I mean, this is already unusable anyway, because it's already dried. But, it's in the lamp. See, this right here is already dry. I can't even push it back up, because it'll just flop back down. So, I'll just let it hang out. And, I'm just going to sit here for, like, I think it says 10, 20 minutes. Let me see. Let me see, because I forgot. Um, 20 minutes. Do y'all see how it's dried? You can see the like white crusty stuff around my eyes and my nose where it just happened to look like a little bit thinner. It doesn't really change shape or settle which is pretty weird and it's completely dry to the tongue. But do y'all see her face on the box? Like, who in the world got her mask to go on so perfect? Because last time I checked, mine doesn't look like that. Does mine look like that? No. Mine's all droopy and clumpy. And I tried applying it with a brush the first time. And I guess since it rubberizes so fast with the oxygen, I don't even know how that works. It just started to dry up in the bristles and it made it really hard to apply with a brush. But y'all can see, look at my leftover mask. Look it. I can totally touch it. It just like crumbles. There's nothing left on my hands besides like the crumbs from it just coming off on my hands. But always when you're doing a peel off mask, you want to do it from the bottom to the top. Obviously, again, you want to lift those wrinkles, girl, not, you know, you know. So, I just like to pull my neck a little bit to get it going. And then, let's see. This one I've never been able to get off in one huge chunk because it always breaks. But we shall see. My chitlin is over here all entertained. not coming off so I'll just do it in one uh. and then just peel it off just peel it off yes. 
So I'm just going to take my towel. They say warm water. I ain't got that right now. So. And they say to dab, but. I'm not really sure how you're supposed to get all of it off just by dabbing. And then, let's finish our skin, shall we? After I cleanse and then after you mask, you just take some cotton around some cotton rail and I'm gonna use my Clinique toner that I got in my little kit and it has this little handy dandy pump here so just gonna put some on those cotton rounds and go to town I asked the lady at the clinic counter if this is alcohol free and either it has some other chemical in here that makes my eyes burn, or it's not. And she lied. Either way, I guess I'll look besides the fact that it's burning my eyeballs because I actually like it. Alright. And then, I mean, after we cleansed, and after a mask, look at all that dirt. You would think there would be nothing there. This one isn't so bad. But you would think there was nothing there since we just technically did a deep clean with that mask, but it's there. Okay. And then, last but certainly not least, our moisturizer. Dramatically different moisturizing gel from Clinique. And I'm just going to take, um... Oh, I don't know. Three pumps. And put it everywhere. I kind of wait a minute for that toner to just like dry. And look, y'all can really see my pimples now. Those are all agitated. I put the moisturizer on. That is what I do. Now listen. I do a mask probably three times a week. Whether it be a mud mask, sheet mask, rubber mask, whatever. But I usually do it at least three times a week because I just like the way they make my skin feel. Okay, let's go ahead and take this one. That ain't cute. Um... And I really think they're beneficial to your skin. Obviously, get some that target your problems, whether it be oily. Um, I do a lot of detoxifying sheet masks. I do a lot of mud masks. Um, but yeah. I mean, this is what it left my skin. Ignore my pimples. But everything else, I think it looks part good. But that's it for what I do to take care of my skin. Um, thanks for watching, guys. I really appreciate your support. And don't forget to like the video or subscribe if you're not already. Thanks. I'll see y'all later. Bye.